Pavia's speech today to persuade you to stay away from tanning beds. Um, I've used tanning beds religiously for over two years since I was literally 16. My mom <laughs> let me tan. I have no idea why she thought that was okay, but they were literally a part of my monthly budget. I used to tan months for prom, sometimes in the winter when I was just not feeling good about myself. I just drive myself over to the tanning salon and tan for 12 minutes and then I felt better about myself. Um, yeah, it was part of my daily routine and one day I was scrolling on Facebook and I saw a family friend who I was super close with. She actually took my senior pictures and she posted a picture of this huge mass of melanoma that she had removed off her back and it was from tanning bed. So I started to wonder like, is this really worth it anymore in the long run? Um, people spend an unhealthy amount of time in the tanning bed and nobody really cares because as long as you tan, it doesn't matter, but um, they don't understand what their life is going to look like in the future. And it most certainly won't be tan, glowing skin, but rather dried up and wrinkled skin. Um, one of the most dangerous ways to voluntarily harm your body is through the use of tanning beds. Um, it's convenient and non-weather reliant. You can go any time of the day, it doesn't matter. Um, they do more harm than good to you. Um, it's way more dangerous than um, going outside and just using the sun's natural rays, although the sun can be very dangerous. These bulbs are directly right, right on top of your body. Um, they're very, very harmful. Um, Piedmont Hospital dermatologist Jody Grant warns that tanning beds are actually more dangerous than the sun. They are so harmful that the World Health, World Health Organization has classified tanning beds now as a carcinogen. In 2009, the International Agency for Research on Cancer concluded tanning beds were moved into the higher, highest risk of cancer category, carcinogenic to humans, which had previously categorized them as possibly carcinogenic to humans. Okay, this is a picture that I found on the internet of just the different statistics about um, using tanning beds. These are different um, effects. These aren't just like things that happen automatically if you tan for three months or something. This is like over the years. Um, these are just the different risks of cancer and